morning, everybody. Craig Fuller, Director of Marketing. Welcome to another week of Fade or Follow Craig. Jumping right into it here. Week five is done. It's in the books. One team remains undefeated at the end of week five, and that is the Arizona Cardinals. They are 5-0. and Arizona beat San Francisco this past weekend, 17-10. to Kyler Murray had 239 yards and one touchdown. Arizona's defense was the big difference in that game. They held Trey Lance to only 192 yards and zero touchdowns. So Arizona is 5-0. and They're the only unbeaten team left in the NFL right now. There's a bunch of teams right now in the NFL that are sitting at 4-1. and We got the Chargers, the Ravens, the Cowboys, the Rams, Green Bay, Tampa Bay, and Buffalo. Out of all those teams that are still 4-1, there are two teams that pique my interest. One of the teams that I find interest in right now is the Dallas Cowboys. After losing their home opener to Tampa Bay, they've won four straight. Their record is 4-1. This weekend, the Cowboys play against New England. New England right now is getting four points, or if you want to take Dallas straight up on the money line, they're sitting at minus 200. So if you bet $100 on the Cowboys with the points, you'll win $93. And if you bet $100 on the Cowboys to win straight up, you'll win yourself $51. So take a look at the Cowboys this weekend. I think that's a good bet. Dallas over New England. The other team that I find interested in is the Buffalo Bills. I mentioned them last week that they're going to be going far this season. They had another dominant weekend. They beat the Kansas City Chiefs this week 38-20 to to improve their record to 4-1. and Buffalo has put up 172 points compared to only allowing 57 points this season. Defense wins games. They've had two shutouts so far this season, and Josh Allen is on fire. He's, as I mentioned last week, he, he added to his stats this week. He's now sitting at 1,370 yards and 12 touchdowns. That boy is good. Current odds to win the Super Bowl right now after five weeks in. The Buffalo Bills and the Tampa Bay sit at top at plus 600. So that means if you bet $100 on either of those team, two teams to win the Super Bowl, it'll get you $600. My initial pick of the LA Rams to win the Super Bowl has dropped to plus 900. I did get them a little higher with that, but right now they're sitting at plus 900 to win the Super Bowl. I still think that is a quality bet. Also, after five weeks into the season, we have a new front runner for the MVP. Josh Allen is now the favorite to win the Super Bowl or to win the MVP title. He is at plus 400. He took over from Kyler Murray. Uh, Tom Brady, a very interesting pick. He's at plus 900 to win the Super Bowl. Keep an eye on that one. I do think that is a good bet uh, to win the MVP. Uh, it's an interesting bet as Brady leads the league in yards thrown. He's only one touchdown pass behind Patrick Mahomes, who leads the league in uh, touchdowns thrown. But the difference is Tampa Bay is 4-1-1. Kansas City is 2-3. So keep an eye on that for Tom Brady to lead the league as the MVP candidate. So last week, I bet $100 on a parlay. I let you guys know all the picks I was going to take. I ended up taking Buffalo to win straight up on the money line at plus 118. I also took Dallas to win by seven with the point spread. They covered. And I also took the Houston Texans to cover with the point spread against the New England Patriots. They were getting nine and a half points. All three of those games covered, so my $100 bet, I turned that into $699. My picks for week six, here they are. I like the Dallas Cowboys on the spread sitting at minus four. Seattle on the money line versus the Steelers. Right now they're at plus 182, and the Bills with the spread of minus five and a half. A hundred dollar bet on all three of those games will win you $923. Those are my games for this week. I hope you bet them. The one million dollar pro football frenzy. Play at MohawkCasino.com. All right, week five of Beat the Marketing Director is in the books. I had a total of 10 picks correct. So if you had 11 picks or higher, you're an automatic winner. You have from Wednesday to 11.59 on Friday to come on in to collect your $20 in free play. Congratulations to all those 150 people that beat me. We'll try again in week six. Good luck.